Welcome to Chocolate Almond Milk. In my last video, I promised I was going to explain why my video series is called Chocolate Almond Milk. In order to do that, I gotta tell you a story. Okay, here's the lineup. A couple days ago, it was a Tuesday. Last Tuesday. Last Tuesday, I was going to film the first episode of my new web series. I was going to call it Jeremy Lynch. You can't pay for a better name than that. That's gold right there. I'm telling you, it's a great name for a series. But I thought of an even better name, and here's what happened. I was getting ready to film my video. I came to my room, I started my camera. Actually, it's my iPhone, but it has a camera. I started my camera, I sat down, I started telling a story. But before I told my story, I did something else. I went down to the kitchen, made myself a glass of almond milk. I, uh, I don't drink real milk anymore. It gives me headaches and makes me fart. In order to relieve my own discomfort and that of those around me, I basically dramatically cut back on the amount of dairy that I take in. I basically don't drink any regular milk anymore, which, ugh, but now I drink almond milk, so everything's okay. Almond milk is boring. So I made me some chocolate almond milk. So I'm coming up the stairs with my glass of chocolate almond milk, and I had an idea. I had this story planned out that I was going to tell you guys. This is an awesome story, completely unrelated to chocolate almond milk. But I figured just for the heck of it, I was going to talk about chocolate almond milk um, when I was done with my story. So I put my chocolate almond milk right here on my head post of my bed so that I could just grab it when I needed it. And then I began my story. I recalled those details. I threw it out there. I gave my all. The story I was going to tell was actually something hilarious that happened to me last year. It was a life-changing moment for me. I was talking about a conversation I had with Siri. Hello. Yes, Siri actually is in the story. And I was getting up to the good part, the part where there's an explosion. Two objects collided at high speeds and exploded. And then collided with other objects. It's a true story! I was building up to the climax. I was getting to the part, and to really emphasize the point, I jumped up in the air, landed on my bed, and shook the whole room. Forgetting that my chocolate almond milk was on the head post of my bed. So when I hit my bed, I realized I didn't think this through too well. All the stuff I have piled up over here avalanched on top of me, including my chocolate almond milk. So there I was, covered in chocolate almond milk, with chocolate almond milk on my blankets and sheets. And it's in those moments of life when something hits you you just don't expect that the real you comes out. People have all sorts of thoughts, like... gonna stay oh my ah! but not me this time was different the first thing I thought was oh my goodness not my chocolate milk I was gonna drink that the second thing that occurred to me was this I can use this I now know what I'm gonna call my series chocolate almond milk it's not as good as Jeremy Lynch but hey, what you gonna do? When life gives you chocolate almond milk, you make chocolate almond milk. The story that I told that day, I still wanna tell you guys, it's a great story. So if you wanna hear the story, here's what you do. Subscribe to my channel, and I promise YouTube will let you know when it's ready. With this series, you never know what you're gonna get from one episode to another. You can get me telling you a funny story from my life, you can get video of something that happened on a regular day. You can get a funny skit. You never know what's going to happen. All right. I'll see you guys next time. We'll discuss life. I'll tell you a story. 
over a glass of chocolate almond milk. I now know what I'm going to call my series.